This one has the dyes that much. Is it the fish? Yeah, all the fish and uh, all the accessories get dyes. Um, it's just the sentiments that don't. So. <coughs> now you can see there the dyes that will match, and they will have a little. Um, you can see that the blade is kind of in the ins more in towards the inside of the edge. Yeah, the blade. it's like so a slight border of it. Yeah. yeah. Very good. I'm going to show you the dies as well. So let me show you the dies here. You can see that there is a tiny um, border, white border, when we put them in here. There is that border there. There it is. I love this card. I love the cords. That's just so beautiful, those knots. It's quite grown up. Isn't yes, it? yeah, yeah. Do I mean it's yeah. quite grown and, up? But also, I kind of think this is, would be perfect for wedding imitations, tying the knot. Yeah, yeah. Or if you've got any nautical stamps in your collection, yes, like boats, absolutely, straight yeah. away it'll tie in. But I think this one's, uh, you know, if you put them as stamping and embossing into with gold embossing powder, that would work really uh, well. Uh, then, of course, we, oh, I love, <laughs> oh, shallow, shallow. Lovely I love eyes. The, oh, and then there's these other sentiments in here. Uh, I'm, Simon, you have to say it. You, <laughs> I cannot say that. Have a Joseph Have a Jolson birthday. birthday. Mm, I like that. I like that. And that one, of course, uh, catch you later. And that one, there is another one. You say, what's the catch? What's the catch? The catch is the hook. Ah, oh, <laughs> it's the you, hook. Which yeah. you can add on if you want to. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. I like that. I like that. So beware of the hook. Uh, yeah, that's, that's a good one. You got me there. Thank you very much. You can see in here, of course, the stamp and uh, in there as well. And now, uh, finally, of course, we have got catch you later there with those uh, backgrounds. Love that. A little bit more mixed media sort of backgrounds, jelly prints, and so much more in there. But of course, we have got more in there. If you want yours, well, this bundle, 458869 is your item number. Fluxing it in the club that means that you pay £13.20 and £20 today. First of three payments, interest free, of course. £11.38 and £38 is your saving if you are in the club. Moving on to two dice sets that we have got in here. Perfect for building those scenes, right, Simon? Yeah, the real um, like basis for your cards, aren't they? they Straight are. away. Now, I have to show this one first because I, th I love. Oh, sorry. That was, that was an implant. I don't know what happened there. <coughs> Welcome to Palmer's World. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie. It's fine. <laughs> At least, thank goodness I don't work in pottery related. <laughs> 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 but you can see there as well the pay. Uh, so these are the dies, right? Yeah, so I've used the die to create the shape and then I've just cut um, three different coloured greens of all the plants and I've put them in my hands to make it a little bit fuller. Yeah, I love and it that. And it traps it in really neatly, doesn't it? That looks very nice. So that is that die in here. Can you s I'll put it beside it so you can see exactly how. So that is that. And then, and it could be mountains as well. It could be used as well. The, or kind of the horizon in there as well. Love that. And of course, those dies, you have got four dies in there. And you can use them as a stencils as well. So I'm going to put them vertically in there. And then, of course, we have got the scales that then I love very clever years in here. It's nice, isn't it? And it like that one especially, it's bursting out of the net. Yes, it's exactly. It's really good. It is kind of bursting. And here is the hook. That's the catch. <laughs> I love that. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just gonna, you are s officially awesome. Awesome. I like that. They're good, aren't they? They're yeah. good sentiments there. And of course, they're, they're your ideas, aren't they? Well, I'll we'll try. You're clever, <laughs> Uh, oh, that one as well. We have got another one. Of course, uh, we are talking about the dies and, of course, the the, um, the dies that we can be used as stencils. But you can see them in there as well. Love that card, giving that sense of depth as well. And really easy, isn't it? It's just coloured pieces of paper. Indeed. And then, of course, we have that one as well in here. So lots of possibilities if you want yours. 182256 is your item number. £28 and £79. And of course that has as well I should mention the outer die and it the inner well. so, so they can sell. Uh, £9 and £60 is your first payment of three. Uh, interest free of course. Uh, £5 and £19 is your saving if you are flexing it in the club or one of payment as well in the club that would have the same saving. Shall I disappear? I'll disappear. <laughs> Um, then we have the stencils. They're just um, great um, starting points, aren't they? They are. For your collection. Very busy for these ones. Do, can I say, can I ask, as a paper crafter, as a car maker, um, stencils, are they great, are they good for a beginner? 
Definitely. So it gives you the impact straight away. It allows you to actually colour blend as well. And yeah. I think that reveal when you take the stencil off and you see what you've made, it's fantastic. It really is. It makes blending easy. Yes. There's no rules. Just put it on and take it off and see what you've got. Absolutely. I love that. <laughs> have a go. And, and, and this is the thing is, is uh, don't think that you have to be an experienced crafter to achieve these results. Uh, like Simon said, you know, have a go. Have, have a go. go. Have a go. L this is what you were talking about um, rotating, yeah. right? That's just so clever. I love how it's very subtle there. And it, that texture paste as well just it gives a different definition. Oh, again, love that. That fan there, over there. And of course, we see picture, uh, elements from the girls and there. And this is my favorite because it's just such an elegant card in there as well with the fan. Uh, nine pounds and 89 pence is your price for two seven by seven uh, stamps, um, uh, stencil, sorry. And of course you have got that saving. Two ninety nine if you're not in the club, but if you are in the club, of course you have got a further saving. Five eight five three zero eight is your item number. The deal of the day. Well, there it is. Very exciting, isn't it, when you see it like this? But I have. Uh, so that's a paper that is uh, 128 uh, for, uh, paper, A4, uh, and you are uh, £4.95. Uh, four pence is your price now this is a design or this is selected so you can print your USBs you know how uh, they will always say that you know if you have uh, to print CDs or DVD ROMs and things like that you need to have a good quality paper otherwise it sucks in all the inks and you don't want that you want to have the best in a paper possible so the colors are going to be uh, stunning so the ink doesn't get synced into the depth of the paper you want to have that core proper in paper especially if you're going to create inserts especially if you're wanting to mail your cards that you need to make sure that they are as light as possible you want to make me do martin and larry but at a fraction of the cost that if you were doing it with corso this is perfect for all of that Four pounds and ninety-four pence is your price in the club. Five five zero five six zero. Also, it's great for jelly prints because you don't want to use your your more uh, thicker card. This one will get, 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 be great to get those pay thinner um, elements, and then you can mount them to something thicker or perfect as well for art journals that you want to have thinner pages. Right, that's about the deal of today. But of course, uh, the big deal that is having Simon here today. So you. you have got a demo prep, right? I have. Yeah. Well, fantastic. So, shall we have a go? Let's get started and have, have a go. Let's have a go. Well, I won't have a go. You will have a go. So, right. so I'm going to start off. Do you want to see the finished card? Or should we keep that secret? Uh, yeah, sure. yeah, of course, yeah. So this is what we're going to show. So we're going to we're going to show you how to make this card, and this is going to show you how effective that um, silhouette oh, background is, I love that. and how um, lovely you can make a card so simple. It really is a fast card to make. So, let's have a go at this let's one first. Uh, sorry, I, I, I will keep saying it. Yeah, no, it's just like, is there? Or is this going to... Right, so I've got two blue colours. I've okay, got a light yep. and a dark. So let's start off with the light one first. Fair I'm just going to ink from the edge and just build some of this colour up. Okay. Towards the centre. I only need to do the top half of this as well, because the bottom half is going to be covered by the silhouette. Right. So I'm just building that up around the edges. Okay. Into the centre a bit more. So building gradually those colours. Could we use, uh, is there uh, dye based inks that you are using right These now? are the eyes ink yeah. dye ones, which I think are probably on your website. Yeah, probably. So yeah, have a look. Uh, Shop by brand, so maybe eyes ink or uh, Stan Swimmy. Uh, we do have some mini inks, but I think those ones are pigment. Could you do that with pigment? You, you could, they're just a bit slower drying, aren't they? So you'd have mm. to probably um, just use your heat gun a little bit more. Yeah. But I tend to use them for like coloured sentiments. Ah, and, then, right. and then you can make them glossy. And yeah, we can buzz Just add a lot of yeah, um, detail of to that. It'll look lovely. Of course, it is. So just dragging that down a little bit more. And I'm just going to swap to the darker colour. Yeah. Just to take a little bit more to these corners. Right. Making it all wobble the desk, aren't I? <laughs> yeah, well, it's, it's, it's our counter, so a little bit wobbly. Wobbly. Yeah, this is uh, but kind of building gradually the intensity. And I always like that to see the, the edges, how they, uh, when do you lift it up, it's just like, oh, wow, it's magical, isn't it's so, it? It's um, so easy, isn't it, to close yeah. up. So that's us back in. So I'm going to yeah. put that to one side. I'm going to bring in the die cutter now. Perfect. So I'm just going to put that over just a second. 
I think you are a tidy crafter, aren't you? <laughs> Debatable, that one. Uh, so I think <coughs> that you are a tidy crafter, which means that probably a normal person doesn't think that you are tidy, but as a crafter goes, yeah. it's tidy. <laughs> this bit you see is tidy. <laughs> the bit like, that we don't see. It doesn't. Yeah. So I'm going to place this onto some plain black card. Right. Towards yeah. the top, so we've got a nice panel of it to yeah, work yeah. with. And we're going to pop this through the actual. Perfect. Just run this through. Yeah. I like to cut dies as well, just to show you how well they do. So this, uh, you're using an uh, A5 die cutting machine, isn't it? So yeah. you don't need to have a larger one at all, or A4 or something like that. No, no, I think, and even the, you know, the narrow ones as well. I think oh, this is because they're quite yeah, narrow strips. I think yeah. you get to work on that as yeah. well. So. We'll just pull this so you bit can out. use, uh, but uh, of course, if you want to do maybe onto a neighbor eight card, you would need a larger car, uh, machine. So it's, it's the ability yeah. to do uh, with different sizes as well. So, that's so I'm just going to tease these little areas out. What's so delicate yeah. around the tree? Okay. Just love that Japanese theme. Yeah. I love the effect it gives. Yeah. Mm, nearly right. and I love that tree. It's just kind of. And are you a fan of Japan then? I'd love to go. I really would love <laughs> to go. I, I love all the um, colours and the vibrancy. So oh. I'm going to put that piece there a second yeah? while I just oh, cut okay. the second bit. Oh, look, look at the trees as well. It's just like, look at the delicate nature of them. It's everything. It's just, oh, it's just this around maybe a candle, artificial candle or something like that. I'd look lovely that one. That would it? look beautiful. That's just. Or maybe if you put like, um, a vellum and put a tea light behind. Absolutely. And then it just glow yeah. through, wouldn't it? That would be so nice. Under a flat, yeah, absolutely flat. Yeah, that would. There's so many possibilities with open dies, as I call it, or edge dies like this. It's just so many. Let's move that out of the way. So this is our little bridge and tree. So you can see it oh, just cuts through. Yes. We're going to tear the edges because we don't need the edge Love bit. That. So a really nice instant effect, isn't it? That's just, and that's just so beautiful. That the kind of beautiful Japanese pine tree in there as well, and that bridge in there. It's just so, and the undulations there as well. It's just so perfect, so beautiful. Uh, uh, right, I just love it. I, I, I know, and, I see and, so and many you could use that as well without using the other bit. Quite of easily, course. you could pick which bit you'd like. So I'm going to put a bit of glue onto the back of this now. Yeah. Okay. Some little bits up here. Yeah. And you can see our inky background now. Yeah. Really makes it pop. Put that down. Yeah. And then we'll get the other one on. Towards the bottom. Yeah. I tend to like lift these up a little bit uh, as well to yeah. get a little bit of shadow. Yeah. And then you can get a little bit more definition with it. Absolutely. And if you had like the pigment, uh, you have with the pigment pads that we have, some of the lighter ones, could we put it on, on top of the black to have a little bit of a colour? You or? could do, or maybe a little bit of glitter. Oh, glitter. Do you know what I mean? Yes. Let's go glitter. glitter. Oh, Let's go fabulous. You could double cut it and maybe like a silver, oh, and then just kind of offset yes. it a little bit so you get like a the shadow. Silver lining. Every cloud. Every cloud. <laughs> you are on it. It's great to have Simon here. So By the way, if you, of course, want to email us in uh, studio at createandcraft.com, uh, welcoming Simon, and also any questions for Simon. So you turn it, sorry, I interrupted That's okay. you. I just um, turned it over and I've chopped it level with the actual card that I was inking on. So we can see instantly we're starting to get a card coming together now. Perfect. Yeah. I really love that. And I'm just going to mount that onto a white layer so it actually makes it pop a little bit more. Yeah. Uh, if you have heard something, some, some, uh, yeah. Uh, shall I, no, they will check. He's, he's the one who always complains about making us uh, noises in the floor. So, Chris Webster <laughs> just uh, almost knocked over. Uh, <laughs> Full on it. Oh, actually, I do know the, his middle name. He told me the other day. So, Chris Albert Stephen, uh, Stephen Webster. That's the full on name. Sorry, it's just he always gives us all the name and Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so, so. so I'm going to mount this on a bit of blue glitter now. 
Oh, I love the glitter in there as well. And we'll mount that onto a white card bank. Ah, yeah. oh, look at that. that is. And then if I just get my... I've got a sentiment just to finish it off. Perfect. And then I just... And I love how love. you have got uh, traditional sentiments with that, uh, you know, oriental look, but also some more with a more graphic font as well, so you have got a mix there. And we'll put that up here mm. in the corner. There we go. Yeah. And that's our first card. Right. Put that there for you. And now, you have done that pretty much from scratch. Oh, no. <laughs> in, in about less than 10 minutes. In eight minutes. I can't be too fast. <laughs> you are so many. good. I mean, Simon, but that shows cases that how amazing these designs are and those stamps. So if you want to do half a go, uh, a 13 pounds and 20 pence, that's the first flexi in the club, uh, 13 pounds and 20 pence, the first of three, uh, and you're saving 11 pounds and 38 pence. Now, that's uh, using the dice and one of the stamps, so, but there is lots more. There's lots of uh, stamps in there included. Is it 20 stamps that you will get? 24? Actually, I was being cheeky. I'm not giving the four next time. I was going to keep them. I like to keep the stamps. I don't worry. I'm not. I won't, I won't keep them. But there you have the dice, two dice. And we have, of course, the three ladies, the Japanese ladies. The, I love how easy uh, is they are to uh, kind of stamp with them and create beautiful cards. Look at this one. Look how gorgeous that little um, screen, Japanese screen, or maybe do you look at that with all of them and of course birthday blessings in there but what about making a more traditional looking car with those beautiful imperial cranes flying out as a symbol of good luck and they are magnificent aren't they with the bamboo there as well with a beautiful look at that <gasps> love that and I love how you can go from very cutesy, very Japanese, in fact, uh, you know, the Japan Japanese love that cute element of, you know, that kind of fun element, but also they do like the amazing traditional one as well. So if you want to do a little bit of gold, red and black, which is, of course, traditional, which is such an oriental one, of course, you can do that. The regal of the embossing powder there, uh, you can see that element kind of coming in. Then, of course, you have got the bamboo in the background, giving that a different lines because they are horizontal. Hello, friend. Uh, eight, seven, uh, or it would be hello, friend. Oh, sorry, that shouldn't have done that. Anyway, uh, but look at that. Look at this one. A kind of uh, expanding, elongating, that glorious die in there. Love that. Showcasing how you can bring more to your dies if you want to extend them. 870-295 is your item number. Now, this one you are loving. You're loving the fish. You are loving that and the puns, you are loving the backgrounds, you are loving, I love the knots in there because of course they make that beautiful sentiment of, of course, tying the knot, being a strong as well, resilient, but also catching the, the fish. If you want to catch the fish, you have to throw your hook out. Anyway, I don't know why they went through, but uh, there it is, the hook is there, the bubbles are there, but of course the bubbles could be celebrating a birthday, it could be like maybe something, a card like, oh, you have had a bad day, at, uh, you know, and you want to do art journaling about it, it's kind of, the, you know, have a bath, have it, you know, there's the elements in there as well. Uh, you have got in here, you oct oh, octopi, my thoughts. That's such a cool one as well. Yeah, I thought oh, that's a good one. Like that one as well, because of course you have there as well the, all the fish, but also the starfish there, and you have got the matching dyes for every single one of the fish and the crustaceans in there as well. And of course you can use them as many times as you you want, because the ones that you have got are stamps and dyes. Well, you have them as long as you don't lose them. Uh, oh, these ones, oh, they're so beautiful. Take the bait and go for this. That's what my 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 uh, producer has said. I cannot take credit. I'll never take credit for on it. So I have to uh, give the credit to Meg. Uh, Four five eight eight six nine is your item number. Eleven pounds and thirty eight pence. That's your saving if you are in the club. Thirteen pounds and twenty pence. The first of a three payments. What about? Um, 
Oh, I should bring plastic with them. That would work really well as well. It, it would be really cool as well to do, if you wanted to decorate, for instance, a bathroom and you stamp onto acetate so you can then put them into like a mobile in the winter or you can do them as well into um, tissue paper and wrap around candles as well to have that sort of uh, nature. But of course, you, don't, uh, you know, don't like the candles because obviously the paper but there is so many possibilities as well uh, there is a fun element a kind of joyous element as well so if you want uh, this bundle remember it has all the sentiments like you occupy my thoughts uh, catch ya catch you later uh, then there is of course a shallow shallow I love that one shallow 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 and then of course you have got you are a uh, look at it officially Awesome. Now, of course, if you have gone to the, uh, you know, have, have gone down to the seaside, whether it's a holiday or just uh, for a day, and you want to scrapbook those ideas, these would be perfect. But also, I think it would be perfect for if you have got little ones and you want them to keep them crafting during the holidays. This is uh, something that is a really nice, easy coloring e uh, uh, areas as well. And the fact that you have got die cutting, so you can stamp them, uh, and then they can color them, and then you die cut them, so then they can create to the heart content. So that makes it a little bit easier for getting those little young guns uh, in, interested back in crypto crafting. 458869 is your item number. Another die, well, this one is a purely a die set that we have got here for you. And I love that one. Um, I love this one because you are getting the shells, so stylish scales, which is, of course, is the scales of a mermaid's tail. It could be the shells, uh, but it could be also art deco. It could be also Japanese style because when you start moving it, turning it around, think about die cutting it out of gold and putting over an opulent purple or die cutting it out of maybe gold again or silver, not gold, and then put it onto red. That would work very Japanese and style. But also remember, you have got the separate outer die and then the die that cuts into the card. So that, of course, is what you can create onto with those dies. But then you have the one here, the one that has those four edge dies that you can use them as a stencils. Oh, let's do it. The wrong one, Paula. Wrong way. Right and left. And then when the cameras are involved, it's even worse. You have got two decorative ones and two plain ones that you can overlap and create those images. And let me show you what images I'm talking about. So there we have it. You can see in here how it works that well. And then, of course, you can see it there as well, the kind of elements that can, you can see there. 182, 256 is your item number. 28 pounds and 79 pence is your price. You're saving 5 pounds and 19 pence. And, of course, if you are flexing it in the club, it's just 9 pounds and 60 pence. It's so much easier, isn't it, like 9 pounds and 60 pence to budget for them today. And then, of course, the same amount next month, which is June. It feels that we are in still in January. I mean, thank goodness for the sunshine. I mean, I love the sunshine, don't take me wrong. But um, it just happens so quick, everything. 585308 is the item number for the stencil set of two, the fan, and of course the cherry uh, blossoms in here. Nine pounds, 89 pence is your one off payment if you are in the club. Now, I'm going to say, Simon, my stomach may rumble. <laughs> Because <laughs> suddenly I can feel it being like, Paula, we want more food. So if you're here, my summer rumble, it's me, it's not Simon. I just wanted to make it clear. <laughs> it's not a train either, but just say, just, see, that, that's it. I've done it. It's quite loud. Yeah, you heard it. You heard it. No, the same. Anyway. <laughs> That's, that could be, that's my catch, <laughs> my stomach <laughs> rumbles. <laughs> there you can see it, there you can see the beautiful stencil with those beautiful fans in there. You can put ink, you can put a spray through it. Like Simon was saying, of course, this is an incredible, uh, you know, way to add detail to your, to your backgrounds without having to have an ex years of expertise. If you are a brand new beginner, these stencils are going to give you the detail. You can use st uh, st uh, inks, you can use spritzers, you can use, of course, an uh, embossing paste as well. So you can have all those amazing things, uh, mediums, 
and achieve incredible results. I love the secure uh, the cherry blossoms there as well. Uh, four pounds and nine pence is your saving if you are in the club and you're flexing it in the club. It's just four pounds and ninety five pence, which means basically that as a club member, you should be paying three. Uh, you are saving a, th a, th a, th a third uh, flexing. But if you want it, please do check out your baskets. Very busy for these amazing, fabulous fans and, and of course, the cherry blossoms. Now, if I think our salmon likes a little bit of glitter, glitter, here a glitter, a little bit of a sparkle, and here we have got the textures glitters uh, trio. So we have got the teal, the mustard, and the glass. You can see that this is this is a mermaid. This is a mermaid that has been having a you know having a you know, kind of a bath, and then that's that's always you know that beautiful glitter with this beautiful um, you know hues of yellow, golden tones, and blues. Look, well, say open it and put your finger in it. That's what that I heard in my ear. Look at that. Look at that. That is so. It's glitter and like sequins, isn't it, Simon? It is. Yeah, I think there's some little shapes in them as well. I think yeah. Has that got love hearts in it? Oh. And now two have got love hearts, and one's got circles. Okay, let's. Oh, well, you can see all the little love arms. Oh yes, yes, they are. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we found love. <laughs> we are. Look at that. That is a, in a very unlikely place. But look now, I'm at like kind of a little bit of a kind of. Um, and then we have. Oh, I'm going to put my finger in it. Oh, I love this. Look at this. And there is there's hearts as well here. All yeah. the tiny hearts are lovely, aren't yeah. they? And then, oh look, look at this! It's just getting glitter everywhere. And then I'm gonna put, oh, and also it feels really nice. I have to say. <laughs> and these one out of the circle ones, I think. Oh, I love that one. They are so beautiful. It's such a medley of glitters, sequins, iridescence, and it's a big pot as well, Simon. So I. It'll go up for ages. It will go, it will for, go ages. for ages. Well, uh, you're paying just ten pounds and seventy-nine pence uh, there as well. It is a bargain, uh, especially if you flex it in the club. It's just five pounds and forty pence. Uh, you're saving four pounds and eighteen pence uh, there in the club. Uh, Seven three zero nine four six is your item number. We have got other items on the show. I'm, I'm going to be very good and clean it, clean the mess that I made. Uh, right, of course, if you want some icing sprays, we have got the fast. A drawing set of four. Uh, the colors may vary. Uh, there you have it. Uh, oh, so, well, so remember the colors will vary, but they, they will be beautiful because Seth After has got such a amazing, cool color uh, stories and they, everything coordinates as well. 19 pounds and 79 pence with a seven, uh, 4 pounds and 17 pence um, say, uh, saving there. 409 491 is your item number. Your mini ink pads, they are pigment. You are getting 20 assorted colors. 12.99 is uh, your price. You are saving two pounds there. 170510 is your item number. And of course, these ones are pigment inks. Uh, top tip, if you are thinking, I don't know if it's a pigment or a um, dye, one of the good ways to distinguish, which is not universal, but it's, it's pretty much, if it has got a transparent lid, lid it's going to be a, uh, a pigment. If it's going to be opaque, more likely than not, more often than not, it's going to be a dye base. So that's a way, good way because pigment is light resistant and dye isn't. So that's how you can tell them apart. And you have got those beautiful colors there, all 20 of them, for just £12.99. And if you are in the club, it's even better. And they are asset free, of course, so you can use them on your memory books right that's the, uh, the ink pads but back to Simon right let's have another demo then so yeah. we've done uh, Japanese so let's go for the fish collection now okay. can so I use... say it let's have a go have a go yeah have so a go. You, that's it now you're in club you're an have a goer yeah <laughs> well why not <laughs> so I'm gonna use these like not um, stamps that we've got I'm just gonna space them down my card so we've got okay. there we go move that magnet up a little bit Let's pick those up. Okay. And I just want to just break this piece of watercolor card okay, with these yeah. images, really. And just get my black ink. Where have I put black ink? Right. Tied it up, Mark. <laughs> now you can see. It's a lovely I detail love, on them. I love that. Bring that over. Oh. 
I love them because I think it's just. So I've, I've got, I kind of, well, I, I went to a wedding this, this weekend. This is why I'm kind of thinking weddings and things. And I, we have got another wedding with a producer and I. The producer is going to, Meg is going to be my date. Or I'm going to be her date. Um, I mean, just friends. I'm just making sure of that. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, but it's just kind of thinking the weddings for sending a card for the bride and groom as well. That is just beautiful. Stamp and emboss into vellum, maybe? It'll look lovely, wouldn't it? Especially embossed. I think yeah. that would really bring it out. I'll just get rid of those two because we don't need those. Mm. Oh, very good idea again from our Mac. Um, using them to create frames for pictures. Definitely. Love that. And have you tried to fussy cut them to create like a little dance as well? Like kind of you can. I think um, something I know as well made like napkin <gasps> holders because they're doing yeah, a party, so they, they put them on like the edge of the napkin. So they call it yeah. napkin ring, yeah. whatever it's called. There you go. So, get rid of those. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I love. I have to say, just like that simplicity. I think it's it's very unique, but it's very it beautiful and so detailed as well, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. So I'm just going really. a bit of colour to this now. Yeah. So first of all, I'm just going to just put a water stripe over these just to make it a little bit more. Absorbent. Yeah. I'm just making oh, like sure it's it. over the knots and not mm. all the card. Yeah. Love that. Do you like the seaside? Is that the inspiration for It's it? so relaxing though. I love the yeah. seaside. I think we all do with not being going away lately. <laughs> well, which, uh, which, which, which seaside do you like to go to? Which is, um, My all-time favourite has got to be Whitby. Oh! Yeah. I pa yeah, the, it, has, it has got the ruins, doesn't it? The, yeah. yeah. That's yeah, that's nice. Is it Yorkshire? It's South Yorkshire? Um, or is North it? York. Yeah, I think it's no, Yorkshire. Oh, yeah. no, Yorkshire. North well, Yorkshire, North Yorkshire. Yeah. Yorkshire. Yeah. So I'm just going to add a pop of this red, and just drag ah. that across. I'm not really bothered if it's a bit rough. I just want a bit of a pop of colour going on no there. Idea. Same with this one. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Dragging it across there. Somebody told me that the best fish and chips um, shop in the world was in Whitby. There is a lot of fish and chips. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I suppose every seaside town. I think have. everybody has a favourite yeah. though, don't they? Where they like to go. Yeah. So I'll drag that over across, and then I'm just going to swap over to a blue colour. Right. I'm going to go for the alternate ones. Bit nautical as well, being red, it white, is, and blue. Yeah. So I'll just drag across that one. I did this card um, by mistake, and I quite liked it. That's what I'm doing I today. I love it. I have I to really say, I really did think I'd like yeah. it. I really enjoyed making it. It's just beautiful. It's it's just coming across, and I there is something about um, nautical theme that sometimes is a little bit too. Um, how do I say it? It's too specific, uh, but this is great because you can then do it in so many different ways. Like you know, you can make it nautical. You can make it into uh, like the wedding. We can do. You can do it in another. Um, I'm just gonna make a quick blast for my heat gun just to try that wetness off. Doesn't work. I'm naughty about you. So <laughs> naughty instead of oh. naughty. No, no, so no, that's a good one. Yeah. That. yeah. I like what you said. So I'm just trying that off a little bit. Oh. Oh, don't worry. It's, That's fine, okay. it's fine. It's fine. I'm worried about that, and the next in a minute I'm going to splatter it anyway. So okay. that's a, that's a beautiful thing about creating these um, these techniques, isn't it? That there are no mistakes. And even if you have this, uh, do you ever have to remind yourself it's just a piece of paper? All the time. It's still it's still in it. I mean, yeah. you want it to go right first time. So I'm just going to get some of that blue splatter going on there just to break it up a bit more. And then swap over back to the red. Mm. Mm. Just get some of that red. It just breaks yeah. them so it's not so white in between. Okay. And then we'll just blast that again. Okay.
I really love this. I'm just going to bring up a piece of towel, just to take that excess really, off so it don't go anywhere. I really, really love. I mean, I, I'm going to say, I just love it so much. Look at that. Love this stamp set. It's just, you know, like, it's, it's great to see a stamp set that automatically you want. And this is, to me, that is it. And of course, it's in a bundle. Uh, you, you can pay just 13 pounds and 20 pence today if you're flexing it in the club. So move my stamping platform out of the way just a second. And we'll get this matted onto some black paper. Yeah, perfect. Nobody sees them, do they? I like <laughs> it. I actually like it. I think it's really well done. There we go. Yeah. Get that onto there. Right. That is just good. And we'll it? mount that onto his white card. By the way, we have got, you know, it's going really fast this hour, uh, always is when, when you're having fun, but um, we have got more cards to, you have got more demos, right? Uh, yes, yeah, oh, yes. Fabulous. probably too many, but, uh, no, but never it could be over-prepared, yeah. isn't it, than yeah. under-prepared. So, let me bring up my stamping platform again. Perfect. And I've cut a small strip of white card and black card, so I've got right. a matte and layer. I'm going to pop this in here first, in fact, well, I'll do. Okay. I'm going to use it on a block actually, it's a bit easier for me. So I've got the shallow. Oh, shallow. We like the shallow, shallow, don't we? Yeah, we are shallow. That could be the, you know, <laughs> two fish in, in a club and they say, what the one says to the other. Shallow. Shallow. <laughs> so I'm just going to print that over and over again on this strip of paper. And that's going to become our sentiment strip. Yeah. Oh, One more yeah. time. And then we'll pop that onto the black. Right. Mm. There we go. And then that can go across oh, our card. I know. I'm seriously smitten with this stamp like and it? the card itself. It, I, I just think it's just. I, th I think it's unusual, it, uh, very beautiful and, and also very, you know, not gender specific, not age specific. So you can yeah. make it a little bit more fun with the fish, but you can also make it a little bit more uh, sophisticated maybe with with something else as well. It's just We've got some of our little oh. fun crabs here, yes. though. So rather than colour them in, in all today, I thought I'd come pre-coloured with these. They're all from the same family. <laughs> we have our magazine in a roll, on a roll. Uh, I have to man name check her because I think it's a brilliant idea. Um, uh, Meg was suggesting to put like um, a fishing wire or maybe like invisible threads so to put them like coming down so they would could move like and if they were kind of almost submerged into water. Yeah, or, or maybe like an acetate yeah, stick to the dangle yeah, over. Absolutely. So that would look absolutely. really nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. Sorry if I or just, uh, a panty slider. Oh, yeah. of the crab so many away. ideas, and of course, if you want to make those ideas, you need to check out your pastas. Put your order through, and of course, get the catulator and the twine and the bubble. Thank you so much, Sir Simon. That is uh, an incredible uh, demonstration. Love those uh, those uh, nuts in there as well so much. Right, that is one of the cards you can make. But of course, don't forget there are more cards, more elements that you can use. Of course, from that incredible set. This is exactly using the nuts, but using them vertically with a different color and they look a little bit different don't they and what about using the crab itself in there as well so there is lots of different possibilities but talking about what about coloring the rope to give that one single element in there as well absolutely glorious if you want to go for this bundle you can pay just 13 pounds and 20 pence today if you flexify it in the club with a 11 pounds and 38 pence saving you are getting two stamp sets, A5 as well as a die set that matches all those fish. You're getting the bubbles as well. Four, five, eight, eight, six, and nine is your item number. We have got also our, uh, is it? Oh, the happiness set. Two stamp sets, of course, that is the Japanese inspire. Uh, be yourself as well. 
and you have got them all there with, oh, excuse me, I have got a tickle in my throat. Uh, um, and you have got Sending Hope and all the bamboo, so many elements there. Love that set as well. Uh, 870295 is your item number. And then we have uh, the uh, uh, stencils, very busy for this one, Ten ninety nine for both of them, 7 by 7 in size, so a little bit bigger than a 6 by 6, so perfect for your A by 8, but also to pick and choose different areas of the stencil, even for the smaller ones. Our journaly will look amazing in there. 585308 is your item number, right? Simon, we have got 10 minutes left. Halfway. Yeah, so we <laughs> Should so we, should we um, sense all this background just oh, so we can yes, see it Oh yes, that's a very happening. good idea, yeah. Because that's a really nice. Okay. So I'll pop that on there. All right. And just bring it. Well, it's just flying, yeah, isn't it, time? Uh, absolutely, yeah. Plenty of time. I know. So I'm just going to hold this in place. I'm just going to just get some of this pink down, really, by brushing it out so it's quite vibrant at the edge. Right. And this is what I was saying with the stencils, you really get different effects every time you do it. Okay. So brush that away. <coughs> Down to the bottom bit as well. Okay. Sorry. Sorry, I had to um to drink some water and I had that tickle That's in my throat. That's fine. As you don't leave me. I'm not going <laughs> to. <laughs> so that would be very bad. I'm that <laughs> would be in very much trouble. Don't worry. So I'm just going to move that across. Ideal, I'd take this down actually, but it's, it's, it's fine. It's, it's fine. fine. Absolutely. And of course, you could you could put some iridescent paste over the top or some um, embossing powder, even so elements that. I'm just going to bring in that murder sword, oh which right. is like a really nice turquoise oh. blue. I'm just going to brush that upwards yep. of the fan, just to break it up a little bit. And I know it might not look on here very good, but when you lift it up, yep. you'll be really surprised how that little bit of extra colour mm. just lifts it. And can you fancy uh, cut those fans as well? So once you stencil them and then take it, remove the stencil, yeah. and then use scissors to fussy cut the stencils? Yeah. Oh, the, the fans? Definitely. Yeah. No, not the stencil. Don't fussy cut the stencil. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> They're very expensive. So if I take this off now. <gasps> wow, it's so pretty. So pretty. So let's get that matted onto this car so we've got yeah. this base. Okay, yep. Yeah. on there. I love a black matte. It really just makes the colours pop, doesn't it? Yeah. Put that onto there. Turn it right way around. Okay. I love... That, that, that's a new demo. Straight demand. away. That yeah. is lovely. Yeah. How long have we got? We have uh, seven minutes. We have got oh, we've plenty. Got, we've got absolutely we have got fine time. though. Oh, well, the two. Oh, no, we won't. Yeah. <laughs> well, time. Right, yeah. so... I've pre-cut like a yep. rectangle. Perfect. So it's going to have our sentiment on it. You make me happy. Okay. So let's get that popped on there. I'm just going to do it in black just to yep. make it really pop. Just dink that up. Give that a nice push down. Just do that a little bit more at that edge. There you go. You make me happy. Ah, uh, yeah. And I'm going to take my pink ink that we used on the fan, right, just yeah. to bring it back in. Right. I'm just going to run it around the edge of this piece of card just to give it a okay, vibrant yeah. border. So if you press on a little bit more, you'll get a thicker edge. Right. I need um, a band of colour, but so we're going to use the um, glitter in a minute. Okay. And it'll take on this pink as well. The glitter, we want some sparkle in our lives. Don't we are all you, are you, yeah, I mean, do you, do you like to use a little bit of a sparkle or a lot? Or no, just go for it. Flash in neon lights, glitter. Oh, yes. Go for it. So then I'm going to bring in the glue. And I'm just going to just run it around the edge, really. Yeah. And, and if you miss bits, it do not really matter, does it? Okay, so it's yeah. going to be an effect. Just turn it around. That's there. 
And then we'll get our little glitter pot. Right. And we're using the frosted one. Which is, yeah. And then this will take on any colouring that you put okay, underneath yeah. it. So I'm just going to sprinkle it on and then I'll collect the waste after. Right. Look at them little love arts though. And give that a tap. Okay. Let's put that to one side. Uh, yes, of course. No, just move that aside. I love you make me happy. That's just, and I love that happy so much highlighted as well. So look and look when I tilt it a little bit, can you see the sparkle? Love it. Oh, we're doing for time. Oh, time for oh, so six minutes or oh, okay. five minutes. Okay, right. So you fine. don't have to rush. That's fine. That's you fine. are so good. That's fine. Yeah. Time. <laughs> Yeah, I, I feel I like to finish the card rather than leave oh, it off yeah. for this though. By the way, okay, you're using foam pants. I'm a foam pants yep. user mm -hmm. yeah, as well. Um, is, do you prefer it over gel mediums or things like the, or, or, or not the gel, but you know, the ones that are silicones and things like that? I, I think they all have the place. I think silicon gives you a lot more height. Yeah. Um, and it means you can angle it as well, where mm -hmm. foam pads, although it's, I mentioned it's flat. So yeah. I think it's just playing around really in what you prefer. Absolutely. So I'm going to bring in a feather for this one. That's I mean, someone's brought the sparkle, the feathers. Oh, no. I mean, I should have brought a brower. Oh yes, you should have. Oh, that would have been so fabulous. I'm just going to tuck that in behind that panel we've made, yeah. just to break it up. Yeah. And then we've got our little geisha girl that we made. Yeah. I've already started colouring it, but you'll get the gist. And then we're just going to add a little bit more pink onto these. Yeah. To finish it off, and then we can just tie in them colours again. Right? Yeah. This is when I like to use, um, you know, like the sprays on the counter. Yes, yes. what you can do is you can spray all your ropes to yeah. the same colour, and okay, you've got yeah. all your accessories. So I'm just adding a bit of that pink back in. Yeah. Into a hair. And then um, just a little bit of glue onto these. Mm -hmm. I think we need a bit more glitter. Yes, why not? Just we need a sparkle bit more in our glitter. lives. Lives. Lives lights. Bits here. Yeah. And student, you're using so little, aren't you? You don't need to use a lot. Yeah. But you can if you like. <laughs> <laughs> so sometimes more is more, isn't it? I oh, know. You might, if you've got it in your stash, use exactly. it. Exactly. If you have got a good stuff going, but no, you, you know, you should should keep it going. Oh, I love that. Thank you so much, Simon. Uh, now, of course, we have got about two minutes left. <laughs> no, 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 don't worry. It's like, Simon, make a card from a scratch in two minutes. Don't worry. We are cruel, but we are not that cruel to our new years. Uh, now, of course, that is uh, using the happiness set. But I'm going to show you some of my favorite ones on these because um, look at this. You could do, I mean, how different does, does one does it look? You can see in here that uh, you have the traditional look. But what about my favourite? I think this is just so clever. It's so colourful, isn't it? And so colourful as well. Now, of course, if you want to go for the uh, Have a Go uh, Ink uh, Happiness set, uh, you are getting a two stamp sets and one and die set for £43.99. £99. Unless you're in the, if you're flexing it in the club, it's just £13.20. And £20. That's the first payment of three, £11.38. And £38. That's your saving. You're getting what you can see in, in, in front of your skin. But look at that. We have got a different cards that the cards that uh, Simon has on and finished three full on cards. Love, love them. By the way, Simon, you are back at 7 p.m. I am, yeah. With Yana. So, uh, do you know more or less what you are going to be using and demonstrating? They're on the island, but don't Ooh, show anybody. Oh, I want to come back. I can see some fish. I can smell some fish. <laughs> we'll get some chips. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's get some fish and chips. Oh, no, I have to work. Uh, but there's a good fish and chips here in Antel, so if you if you are fun singer, I'll give you the name later. Anyway, here in Create and Craft, though the crafting continues, you will be happy to know, but don't forget to check out your baskets. Uh, in the website, createandcraft.com, you will have, find all the different bundles from Have A Go uh, Ink, uh, Inc., including the stencils, including, of course, the stamps and dies, and, of course, 
those those background dies but don't forget the deal of the day perfect to print out your USBs and CD ROMs you are ha you are getting a hundred a four of the core pro print paper and also it's great to stamp on and of course a great to die cut with if you want to do so don't forget if you want a little bit of a sparkle in your life you can get the textures glitter to you the teal the mustard and the glass and of course the inks as well they are there for you to check them out and of course check the, your baskets out on the website createoncraft.com or if you prefer to give us a call of course you can do that into the local rate number uh, here in Andal. right it's been an absolutely uh, absolute pleasure Simon what you would say to the uh, viewers <laughs> out there I don't know, now you put me on the spot. Have a go. Have a go. Have a go. Oh, no, it's been really nice. Thank you. Oh, great. Thank I'm you. so glad. Uh, you will be with at 7 with uh, Yanis Perdi.